The reverse osmosis system is officially up and running on SAP. We got a piece of tape here indicating where our starting level was. And we're gonna look to try to get it down into the 25 to 30% of where we started at. So first inside of the tub, we are picking up the raw sap. concentrate is coming back through and it will be at a higher sugar content than what we start with since some of the permeate water will have been removed. Up on top we have the pickup tube coming out of the barrel into our pump. Pickup water comes through a sediment filter. The uh, pesky fittings on the sediment filter after multiple tries still want to leak so we will monitor that and make sure it behaves throughout the season since we're sitting right here on top of the barrel it's free to run back in and still get captured we are still running right in the 150 psi range move over to the reverse osmosis membrane so flow is coming in going through a four inch by 12 and a half inch membrane. And so the permeate water is usually in reverse osmosis. This is the water you're gonna wanna drink. In this case, this is the water that we wanna get out and I'll use it for some cleaning. Maybe we'll be drink it for uh, see how it tastes. And then we have the concentrate line, which is often called the brine, uh, coming through, restricting it so that we get a higher pressure to encourage the flow across the membrane. And this tube is coming back in, and that's again at the more concentrated level than what it started at.